Aries, 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 Aries. Doom, 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 doom. Aries, 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 Aries. Now, that ain't wait. Look, if the coffee didn't wake you up, guys, the macchiato, the latte, the morning sex, look, I'm pretty gonna wake you up. I know this woke you up. <laughs> hey, Aries, how the freak are you guys doing? Welcome back here. This is gonna be an all signs bonus reading from my dear Aries, okay? Um, please understand, as always said, this is a general reading, so take what you need for your situation. Leave the rest for somebody else. Um, now, this does apply to Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the Venus, okay? Um, if you happen to be watching this, cross-watching for an Aries, just understand this could be playing out from your perspective. If the Aries did X, Y, and Z, okay? My smoke alarm is literally right there on top of my work area, so I hope it this doesn't set it off, but we need some good energy in here, guys, okay? So please, please, please do not forget to hit that like button if you have not already. Thank you guys so freaking much. So let's see what's popping. Let's see who the freak, why the freak, what the freak, okay? <laughs> Stay away from the freaks this weekend, Aries, okay? I mean it. <laughs> I mean it, Aries, because there's nothing else I can do for you if you, if you deal with the freaks this weekend. <laughs> All right, let's put this here. My daughter did something with my my uh tray so you know, it's kids <laughs> all right aries sun moon rising and venus all signs towards the end i will be going from aries to pisces what each of these signs would want to say to you through my channel messages deck okay if you are new here please join the pretty gang family and subscribe set your notifications to all okay hit the nail the bell um i said the, nail, the bell button on my channel okay all right, what is coming to Aries in love? What do we have coming to Aries in love? Aries. This one says holding back. You have self-love and you also have divine masculine. So you may be connected to um, your twin flame. Okay, this could be a divine masculine. You could be a divine masculine. You could be dealing with another Aries. And we also have self-love in the building. Okay, which is always good. Bottom of the deck is partner. Okay, so let's see. Some of you, this could be about your your current relationship, okay? And what is coming to Aries in love? What is coming to Aries? You may be connected to an Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius. What is coming to Aries in love? Aries. Aries. So Aries, you have the Knight of Pentacles. You have the Page of Cups. What is coming to Aquarius? the hell you may be going with Aquarius. what's coming to aries and love aries <laughs> mm. we have the nine of swords we have the three of swords reverse what's coming to aries and love aries you know what i'm getting aries the shadow side aquarius pulled the same thing as well what's coming to aries and love aries i feel like there may be some real issues around trust um, there could be some emotional issues as well, emotional intimacy problems here, okay? You have the lovers, the nine of wands, and the um, the hermit here. You may be connected to a Virgo, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, like yourself. Oh, did I say like yourself? That was wrong with me today. <laughs> Sorry, guys, but yeah, you could be dealing with a, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, a Gemini. We do have Capricorn here in the center with the shadow side. Shadow, shadow side in this deck is the devil, so what I'm feeling is like, you're wondering if this is going to pay off, Aries, okay? You're like, okay, high risk, low reward. <laughs> and Aries doesn't want to take a high risk and a low reward gamble, right? So I don't know, I'm kind of getting this energy that there's a lot of anxiety, fear, uh, worry about whether this is going to work out or not, okay? Um, I feel like someone's doing a lot of reflecting, thinking at this time. Maybe you're not connected to this person at this time, Okay. But there's a whole lot of that going on here, Aries, for sure. But the Page of Cups Reverse tells me that maybe someone may owe the other person an apology and it's taking them some time to do this. Um, the Page of Cups Reverse can also indicate some kind of childishness or some issues with, you know, um, opening up emotionally. Okay. Some emotional immaturities possibly can be present here. Okay. But I feel like, like I said, with your last reading, there's something about... I don't know why cards aren't 
There's something about this person not wanting to... Let me put my camera down a little bit. Okay, that's better. There's something about this person not wanting you to give up on them, okay? Whatever I'm saying could be reversed. And maybe this person doesn't want to give up on you. But I feel like there's something really blocking this connection at this time. And I think it's what I just what I just told you, okay? Um, you could be connected to a cancer. But the shadow side talks about someone having a shadow side. Something they need to work on, they need to fix if this is to work out. Okay, um, I feel like, you know, someone's already been heartbroken in a situation already, but there is a desire to kind of stick around to see if things are going to improve, if things will get better here. Um, this could definitely be a twin flame connection. Um, and, you know, obviously there there is a shadow side. Someone may have some um, some work to do on themselves if this if you guys are to stay into you stay in union or come into union here. But, you know, Aries, they really do want to kiss you. I want to kiss the Aries. I want to kiss the Aries. Too. Look, pretty want to kiss the Aries. Shit. <laughs> Let me kiss the Aries from Paris. Okay? I want to kiss the Aries from Paris. So, they want to be under this. You know, this is you and them in uh, Paris. And they just want to kiss you just a little bit. Okay? So that's what self-love could be about. Maybe this person has an inner child that they need to work on, okay? Inner child issues that they need to work on if this is to be successful. But right now, someone may be looking at this as a high-risk, low-reward gamble right now. Um, but there's, you know, it's not over. They're still thinking, okay? Um, I feel like Nana wants this person doesn't, they, the freak doesn't want to give up, Aries. They still want to fight for this, even though it's been tough. Very similar to Aquarius reading. So maybe you're Aquarius watching this for an Aries, or maybe you have Aries in your moon rising Venus. If not, um, yeah, this could definitely have something to do with you dealing with an Aquarius. So what is the Knight of Pentacles for Aries and love? Knight of Pentacles for Aries. Seven of coins reverse, three of swords, six of coins reverse. I feel like someone feels as though maybe they've been giving to the situation and it's not really paying off. It's not really, but at the same time, they don't want to give up, okay? There's a lot of worry. The freak can't sleep, Aries. You have the nine of swords here. All right, what is the page of cups reverse for Aries in love? Page of cups reverse. King of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, the Moon. It was like deep down, uh, this person may know that they need to work on something. Okay? I don't know what it is, guys, but something's wrong with this freak. <laughs> what is the Nine of Swords for Aries and Love? Nine of Swords. You know, someone's kind of been ignoring their intuition. I feel like someone's intuition is telling them, you know, don't don't give up on this. You know, don't give up. Okay. So what is the uh, chariot reverse? But we know there's a real big block here um, in this connection at this time. Somebody could be suffering with some abandonment issues. Um, but at the same time, it's like healing may need to be done here, whether, you know, in this relationship or on its own. Someone needs to heal their baggage here. This could be kind of sabotaging things. The hermit is in the reverse. Work needs to be done. Seven of Pentacles reverse for Aries. Two of Wands. Someone's like, you know what? I'm tired of fixing this. I'm tired of working on this. You know, can this be fixed? Can this work? You know, can it work? Someone's like, I deserve better at this point, you know? To a cuz, but at the same time, they don't want to let it go because, you know, apparently you guys have some kind of soul tie here. So, what is this person thinking about? Hermit for Aries and Love. Hermit. Thinking about, can I do anything about this? Can we fix this? But I feel like it's possible, but someone's kind of telling themselves that they can't, you know, some damage has been done here. Um, this could be a result as of childhood traumas or something having to do with the past. Now, if this freak cheated on you, Aries, or did something crazy, I, I mean, I can see that as well. You know, can this be fixed? Can this? And it's up to you. You have free will. What is the nine of wands for Aries in love? Someone doesn't want to give up on this, but it's like things are not getting any better right now. Um, it's like someone may need to just go ahead and do this work, go to that therapy, you know, do whatever you got to do. Okay. <laughs> for real, someone may need a Dr. Phil or something. Okay. Tell me more for, <laughs> okay. So you have the two of cups. You and this person are literally soulmates. Two of cups just flying out here. What else for Aries in this love situation? What else? 
the sun reverse. I mean, there's a whole lot of indicators, Aries, I hate to say it about like childishness, you know, immaturities, you know, things that kind of need to be taken care of here. Six of Swords reverse, the Page of Pentacles. Who pulled the Page of Pentacles reverse? Sagittarius. It's almost like someone may not be fully, I don't know why I get this one foot in, one foot out. It's like, okay. What else for Aries in this love situation? What else? Um, the Ace of Pentacles. So you may feel like you don't have a sturdy foundation with this person. And maybe you feel like this is kind of a waste of time. Um, you want things to change. Things have been the same. Um, you could be done with a Taurus, Aries. Seven of Swords. I don't know if someone kind of avoids these issues or kind of feels like they want to take the easy way out. What else for Aries in this love situation? You know, Aries, I'm probably going to go King of Swords, the Magician. It feels difficult. Someone's like, oh my God, I can't deal with this. All right, so I'm probably going to extend this reading, Aries, okay, towards the end. Actually, not towards the end, but um, yeah, you can look for the extended in the pinned comment section or in the, uh, the uh, description box because it, it seems like you may need a little bit more clarity as to where is this going, you know. Is this worth my time, my effort, my energy, my blood, sweat, and tears, okay? My 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 sad nights, whatever it is, you know, you're stressed out. Is it worth it? Is this worth it? Is it going to pay off? Because this freak may be lacking in self-love and that could be kind of sabotaging things for some of you. All right. Okay, well, we're going to go ahead and get into, um, so as of right now, Aries, unfortunately, if you're not in communication with this person, you may not hear from this person for a little, for quite some more time, okay, because I don't really see communication cards at this time. I feel like someone's still thinking, still reflecting, still in this hermit mode of what to do, but I would say there really is no need to panic just yet because this person may still be kind of, I don't think it's really over that this person, you know, doesn't really want this anymore. I don't think that's the case at all. Okay. But some of you in marriages, you know, maybe there needs to be a counselor or something here, Aries. Okay. All right. So let's see if you're connected to an Aries. What does Aries want to tell Aries? What does Aries want to tell Aries? And stay tuned for the overall messages once I'm done with all the signs. So you have waste of your time. So you feel like you're wasting your time with this Aries. Okay, so this Aries wants to know if you're still mad at them. They feel like you guys belong together. Maybe there's some jealousy issues. They're about to reach out. You have only one sex. So maybe sex is kind of running the show in this situation. Okay. But obviously, you need that emotional intimacy as well with this person. Yeah, playing games. And I left them. Very interesting. So, I mean, this person feels like you guys belong together, but... All right, if you're connected to a Taurus, what does this Taurus want to tell their Aries? Yeah, let's be more than friends. What does this Taurus want to tell their Aries, please? This Taurus says, um, maybe this Taurus enjoys playing the field and they're very afraid of actual commitment. They get uh, butterflies when you talk. Okay, they have pain, major karma. They want to love you better. Oh, we have I'm married. So that's just an indicator. Maybe some of you, this is someone you're married to. Okay, you have insecurities and low self-esteem. Maybe, maybe problematic with this Taurus, okay? Probably might need to go ahead and just move these cards to the side because they're kind of aggravating. Yeah, they're aggravating me. Let me move these on to the shot. Okay. Ooh, there's one card in here. Okay. For those of you who are dealing with a Gemini, what does a Gemini want to tell their Aries at this time, angels? What does Gemini want to tell their Aries? This Gemini says, your love is my drug, baby. I'm not going anywhere. I need to take you every day, okay? If I miss a day of Aries, Aries from Paris, love, 
oh my god okay i might just go into a shock okay yeah i'm emotionally unavailable i don't want them so maybe this uh, gemini has problems with being emotionally available they have problems okay you have only want sex so maybe at this time it's like maybe all this person is kind of good for is sex you have um mad at you so maybe you're you're mad at this this gemini or this gemini could be mad at you the freak could be mad at mad about themselves but at this time they they wonder what you think of them i wonder what you think of me my life is a disaster <laughs> oh, okay for those of you dealing with a cancer what does this cancer want to tell their aries at this time what does this cancer want to tell their aries at this time this cancer says that they're trying to find the right words to say to you. Maybe this cancer was dramatic and unstable, but they want to pursue you, okay? Emotionally unavailable. We have mad at you. I don't want them. Maybe they've been kind of doing, playing stupid games. Wine and dine, we belong together, and I know we're twin flames. So this cancer knows you guys belong together. So what does this uh, Leo want to tell their Aries at this time? What does this Leo want to communicate to their Aries at this time? So this Leo apparently has plans to propose to you. Um, they do want to start a relationship with you, about to reach out. Maybe they were back and forth and unsure. Uh, they say that they were wrong. They're trying to find the right words to say. So you, this Leo probably has been heavily guarded and... Maybe their heart has been cold and they have a blocked heart chakra, but they're missing you, you know, missing you is driving them crazy, Aries, okay? What does this Virgo want to say to their Aries? What does this Virgo want to tell Aries? This Virgo says, only want to fuck. So maybe this Virgo, all they had to offer was just that, okay? But they are hiding their true feelings from you. Maybe they're very dramatic and unstable. Virgo to Aries. They can't move on, though. Their heart and their soul belongs to you. They want to know if you're still mad at them. Still mad at me? Romantic outing and I'm married. So maybe for some of you, this is someone that you're married to, Aries. Okay. You're connected to a Libra. What does Libra want to tell their Aries, please? Libra to Aries. This Libra says, very possessive, not interested. Maybe you're not interested in this Libra at this point in time. This Libra is very nervous to talk to you. Ooh, you have, I only see you as a friend. So maybe, you know, you're only seeing this, this Libra as a friend at this time. Okay, or this Libra could only be seeing you as a friend depending on who's, who's childish as hell. Okay, leading you on playing games and you have watched terror videos to get info. Libra to Aries, please. My life is a disaster. The grass wasn't greener. Single woman, single man. Interesting. All right. What does Scorpio want to tell their Aries? Scorpio says that they have vulnerability issues. Friend zone. Maybe they put you in a friend zone because of that, okay? But they're going to want you to take them back. Maybe they were only interested in a hookup. Maybe you're done with the Scorpio. I think the Scorpio has moved on from someone, some kind of ex as well. They want you to be patient with them, and they want to love you better, okay? They're nervous to talk to you. Well, you better be, okay? Okay, if you're connected to a Sagittarius... What does Sagittarius want to tell Aries? Ooh. So the Sagittarius can have a crazy lifestyle, but they're crying over you. Interesting. Hmm. They're about to reach out to you, Aries. They do regret their poor decisions. Maybe they were only looking for a good time, but at the same time, they refuse to see with someone else, which is a little selfish. Selfish. Sagittarius to Aries. The Sagittarius says, not interested. Watch terror videos to get in info. I was wrong. So maybe you're not, you're just not interested in this uh, Sagittarius games anymore, okay? Time to heal, heart cold, block chakra, huh? If you're connected to a Capricorn, what does Capricorn want to tell Aries, please? Capricorn to Aries. 
this Capricorn is definitely calling from fake numbers. They're like, baby, please pick up the phone because you are the first thing on my mind in the morning and I freaking love you. Okay, they're truly sorry. You have still immature. So this Capricorn needs to grow up. Um, heavily guarded Capricorn to Aries. And they probably know they need to grow up. Only want to fuck. I left them. Hmm. Regret my poor decision. In denial. Well, this Capricorn loves you. They need to grow up, though. Okay. Aquarius to Aries. What does this Aquarius want to tell their Aries? Aquarius to Aries. This Aquarius says dramatic and unstable. Far from average. You have a divorce showing up here. Aquarius to Aries, please. This Aquarius says, leave them for me. It's not you, it's me. Let's keep things casual. Aquarius to Aries. Aquarius to Aries. Insecure, low self-esteem. Let's be more than friends. Paying major karma. You have, I moved on. Some of you are moving on emotionally unavailable. This Aquarius could be a bit emotionally unavailable. They have some problems. Hmm. Okay. Apparently, when the hell do they not have problems? All right, for those of you dealing with a Pisces, what does this Pisces want to tell their Aries? What does this Pisces want to tell their Aries? Pisces to Aries. Friend zone. So maybe this Pisces puts you in a friend zone or they're only interested in a hookup right now. They enjoy playing the field. Infatuated, you can trust me. How dramatic, how can I trust you? And this is exactly what your freaky self is doing. Left you before you left me. Let me explain. Will you marry me? You deserve better than me. So this Pisces has problems. <laughs> this Pisces is crazy. Okay, Aries. Red. All right. Let's get into the overall messages, angels. Overall, what does this person want to communicate to Aries? You guys seen that? So this person says, oh, some of you, maybe this freak took the easy way out. Okay, they left for somebody else. Maybe they thought the grass was greener. Okay, some of you, maybe you left this person for someone else, but they're dying to hear from you. You better not be seeing anyone. You yeah, have living a double life, trying to leave them. Some of you, yeah, this, this is probably third party, but they do watch your every move. What does this person want to tell their Aries at this time, please? Aries. I don't want them. So they, they don't want that phrase, okay? You have deep-seated issues. I won't hurt you. Let's start all over. Deeply in love with you, about to pursue you. My heart and soul belongs to you. Heart cold. I was wrong. I was wrong. Crazy lifestyle. I can't move on. Please take me back. This person's crazy, Aries. I hope you know that. <laughs> So that is what I have for you guys, Aries. Um, so I will be coming out with an extended reading because it does appear that, um, yeah, it definitely does appear that we need a little bit more information about the um, outcome. So if you would like to purchase the extended, it will be in the uh, comments section or the description section. Um, and it is only $5.99, okay? So thank you for tuning in. We'll talk again next time, Aries.